What's up, losers? This is President's Play Wordle. It's the show with hot questions and even hotter wings. That's the wrong channel, Biden. Oh, no. Sleepy Joe is useless, and this will be amazing. Starting on four letters, when we win, we move on to longer words. This video is awesome. Subscribe to Parody Gaming. Let's go. Right, guys, what word should we start with? The word is bomb 100%. Can you just go one video without saying something controversial? How about the word, word? I like it, Joe. I'll try it. This is racist. Why are you accepting his word and not mine? You can't be racist towards people who dye their face to look like a walking Cheeto Trump. And good job, Joe. We know R is the third letter, and there is also a D somewhere in there as well. It's bomb. I'm telling you, the word is bomb. It can't be bomb, you moron. We already know the third letter is R. Obama, listen to me. That doesn't matter. I've played this game before, and it tries to play tricks on your brain. I'm telling you, it's 100% bomb. It's literally impossible for the word to be bomb Donald. Obama, trust me, bro. It's bomb 100%. Just type it. God damn it. It's like working with a child. Joe just put bomb to prove this moron wrong. You got it, Obama. See, Trump, you moron. Not a single letter was correct. Damn, it must be a glitch. I was convinced it was bomb. How were you convinced it was bomb when I literally explained to you how it was impossible to be that? Okay, fine, but I have worked it out. I know what the word is now 100%. Let's hear it, Donnie. I'll try it. The word is nuke. It's 100% nuke. Oh my God, this guy's an idiot. Thank God he's not president right now. I think the word might be ice cream. It's a four-letter word, and ice cream is two words. Joe, holy fuck, that's our actual president. We are all doomed. Biden, you're the reason we have warning labels on shampoo. The word is obviously not ice cream. Now type in nuke and lock it in. The word is nuke 100%, I'm telling you. What should I do, Obama? I don't care at this point, Joe. I can't deal with you two today. I'm just in disbelief that we are most likely going to have to have one of you two as our president again for the next four years. Nuke, sleepy Joe, nuke, 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 nuke. It's actually scary to think this guy had access to the launch codes for four years. Listen, Obama, when I was in office, I had everything planned out. I had a big red button with C on it for Diet Coke on my left and a big red button with N on it for nuke on my right so I never got them mixed up. Hey, I still have those two buttons installed in the office. Yeah, but your C button stands for cocaine now. Instead, you need drugs to just stay awake and keep your heart beating. Now type in nuke before I make the CIA take your drugs away, old man. Fuck you, Donald. You look like the before picture in a before and after body transformation. Shut up, both of you. See, Donald, it isn't nuke like I told you. Screw you, Barack. I got the E right. Well done. You got just one letter from two guesses. All right. What do you think it is then, Mr. Smartass? Why don't you have a guess for one? Well, using common sense and a bit of logical thinking, it's quite easy. We know the last two letters are R and E, and there is a D somewhere else, so most likely the word is dare. So try putting in dare, Joe. No, don't you dare type the word dare, Joe. There's no way in hell it's dare. Joe, type in, Obama is a terrible president. Uh, you can't even type that in. That's a full-on sentence, you fucking moron. Joe, try typing the word lard, because Donald is a fat piece of useless shit. Damn, Barack, you're going off on one today, but I got you, homie. That's a word I can get behind. Ha-ha, <laughs> Obama, you suck. You got it wrong. Yes, but you can clearly see my original guess of dare is right now. So, Joe, type in dare, and let's move on to the five-letter words. I still think it's bomb. Hey, Joe, try bomb one more time, just in case the game was glitching earlier. Joe, don't you dare put the word bomb in again, or I will straight up leave this call and never come back. That's even more of a reason to put bomb. Do it, Joe. Do it. No, Trump. It's obviously dare like Obama originally said. I fully understand how this game works now. See, I told you, Trump, we could have finished this round in 20 seconds if you just listened to me. Okay, looks like we are moving on to seven-letter words. Jesus Christ, Joe, this is a five-letter word round. You're so fucking old, you've forgotten how to count. Yeah, not gonna lie, Joe, you royally shit the bed there. Oh my God, you are right. I have no idea how that happened. I think my computer just glitched out and shown me the wrong round. Whilst our viewers comment below how useless Biden is for the 100th time today. Let's actually play this game. What word shall we start with this time? Oh, what about potato? Biden, if you can't figure out how many letters are in potato, we have a massive problem. P-O-T-A-T-O. -T -T Jesus, sorry, guys. I thought potato had seven letters in it. It doesn't matter if it has six or seven letters in it. Biden, you rotten corpse of a human. We are starting off with a five-letter word. Don't worry about it, Trump. We are used to this now. I know, but he just makes me so fucking angry. You name a five-letter word then. China. Oh, dear. China is a five-letter word. They are toxic and steal everything. Maybe China stole some letters we can use in Wordle. I will type in China and see what we get. Oh, not a bad start, Trump. Could be better, but we have the A. Classic China holding back all the good letters. Greedy, tiny China, that word is almost as useless as Joe. Hey, I'm not that useless, Donald. Yeah, and I don't think China is tiny, Trump. China is tiny and Joe is useless. Type in the word Biden. I bet one million dollars that Biden is the worst five-letter word in the world. Fuck you, Trump. Calm down, guys, it's just Wordle. I bet Trump is the worst word in the world. Ha!
Surprise, yeah. Biden, my name has actually helped. Now we know there is an R and an A. Although this is the worst game I have ever played with you both, I'm glad we have another letter in the bank. Shut the hell up, Obama, you boring snollygoster. Trump is not getting away with this. You do know, Joe, that the word Biden isn't- Fuck! Absolutely nobody is surprised that Biden isn't even a valid word. Not only is it the worst word in the world, Biden isn't even a word in the dictionary. You are so old and stupid, it blows my mind. I hate this game and I hate you. What word shall I type in next, Obama? I'm not making any up anymore. How about Japan? I said, Obama, you chubby ball of melted lard. It's like China, but it's not. Type in Japan. No, I was asking Obama. Japan is a good idea. Even Obama agrees. Type in Japan. No. Type in Japan and I'll stop being mean to you, Joe. You promise? Yes. Well, I guess there is a first time for everything. I will type Japan. I think it's a good word, too. Ha! Suck it, Biden. Once again, my words are the best. But you said... Guess what, sleepy Joe? I lied. Stop getting pranked, Biden. And also, we know where the A goes, too. With only three more tries, we need to make the words count. Unfortunately, Obama, we all learned today that Biden can't even count to seven properly. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Jesus Christ. Thank you, Joe, for that perfect example of not only counting to seven, but also dropping eight and nine on the end like an absolute badass. Thanks, Obama. Now, what about a new word? How about drive? Drive is a terrible word to use, Biden, you shaky zombie. When I'm reelected, I'm going to create the most powerful weapons in the world and just have them pointed at Biden's house 24 hours a day. How on earth is that helping on the next word, Trump? Yeah, Donald, maybe you're the one that can't count to numbers. I'm going to completely ignore that perfectly arranged sentence from Joe and explain myself. My new powerful weapons won't be shooting bullets. That sounds like a rubbish weapon. They will be shooting lasers. Oh, that is actually a really good word. Trump? I don't know about that. Oh, do it, Biden. Type in laser so we can move on to the next game. I will type in laser now, but I have no idea how this is going to help us. You see, Biden, we haven't used L, S, or E yet. Stop it, Obama. Only you can make lasers sound less cool and make them sound boring. And holy shit, I'm a fucking legend. A, E, and R. Call me the Wordle Master. From now on, I know exactly how this game works. Shame you don't know how tax returns work. Oh, Joe, that's a good comeback, and we are so close to winning this round. I have a rough idea what it could be, and we have two more guesses. Racer. Nope, already tried the letter C. Gamer. We can't use that because we used the letter M already. I'm surprised you've even remembered that Biden. You're so old, I would have thought the only good parts of you had rotten away years ago. Age is just a number, Trump. Yes, but yours take fucking ages to count to, and you are literally a walking advert advertisement for care homes. I'm thinking either Faker, Gager, or Baker. Oh, I love bread. Let's go with Baker. Faker is a League of Legends player, not a real name, and Gager sounds like a word Biden called his friends 1,000 years ago when they thought they were cool. I will type Baker, but I don't know. I honestly can't think of anything else. Holy, Holy shit. shit. That's amazing. I told you, I love bread. Joe, nobody cares. Let's move on to the next round. I guess I'll just pat myself on the back then. If we don't start this round with Sleepy, the people will be angry. Hey, I hope that's because you're tired and not because of me. Yes, Sleepy Joe, it's 100 percent because I'm tired. Uh, not the best word to start with, but I understand the humor here. Thank you, Mr. Robot, for your logical and emotionless response to Sleepy Joe. Hey, look, we got the S. Well done, Trump. I don't need your nerdy praise, Obama. I know the coding of this game inside and out now. This will be the easiest round. The only thing round and easy is you, Trump. I'm typing in burger. It's a six-letter word, and if sleep represents me, then a big fat orange burger represents you. Biden, they say age brings wisdom, but in your case, it seems to have brought a fondness for being absolutely useless with zero insight into everything you talk about. Well, it looks like Berger has let us know the letter R. Well done, Biden. Thanks, Obama. Yes, well done on your yellow R, but my green S is much more powerful and useful, so once again, I win Biden. But we are on the same team. The day me and you are on the same team is when you are begging me to turn your life support off. The teamwork on that day will be legendary, and you will die so, so fast. I would like to make a suggestion. Go for it, Captain Robot. Obama isn't a robot Trump. He's been friendly to me for years and always knows the best things to say. That sounds like a robot, Joe. No real human is capable of putting up with you for so long. Something I believe you both need to visit six times a week. McDonald's doesn't fit Obama. Yeah, neither does Marshmallow Underground. What the fuck is Marshmallow Underground? I was suggesting a shrink. I don't respect or listen to Doctors Obama, and Biden needs to go to a doctor so we can and cut him open and find out why he isn't dead yet. I'm literally right here. Yes, and fingers crossed you won't make it another week. Type in Shrink Joe, I think it's a good one. Obama, I'm typing it in right now. Yay, I told you guys Shrink would be fire. Yes, well done, nerd. Now we have the H, what magical word is next? I think people commenting on this video would be lost if we didn't mention your next house, Trump. White is only five letters, Biden. The other house, you orange lump, the big house, otherwise known as prison. Oh, that is a great idea. No, it's not, and it's all fake news and lies. You're lucky I didn't type in pumped, as in 
All the men in the prison are going to pump you all day and night. And once again, another great word. Uh, now we know it starts with S and H and includes R and O. What about shower? As in Biden is so crusty and dirty that even a shower can't wash off all the deadness. Yes, sir, like Trump got pumped in prison today because he dropped the soap. In the shower. Oh, it's genius. I fucking hate this channel idea. Biden is useless and Obama is a nerdy robot. Nerdy is the new cool Trump. If you're so good at this game, Donald, you pick the next word. This might be one of those rounds where it's glitched out and the word is something like bomb again. No, Trump, it's not bomb. I think it is shorts. Or something like potato. No, it can't be potato. It's either something crazy offensive, crazy racists, or something that only I can think of. It's shorts. S-H-O-R-T-S. We can't say anything like that, Trump, or we will get banned on YouTube. I wouldn't be surprised if it's shower again. Oh, okay, I'll type shower and see what we get. No, it's not shower again, you imbeciles. What about shorts? I think shorts fits perfectly. Move over Biden. I'm typing in my idea. Oh, okay. Fuck off. I said shorts. Yes, but you said it after me, and that's stealing Obama. You should know not to steal. I don't remember who said it first, but it's only a game, Obama. Remember, we are a team. Trump said we are not a team. Oh, look, we won, and it was all thanks to me. Now we can move on to seven letters. On to seven-letter word now. Quickly press your cocaine button, Biden. We need your brain working at full power. I didn't even know words went up to seven letters long, if I'm honest. There are plenty of seven-letter words, Joe. We want to start with a good seven-letter word that does not repeat many letters to give us the best chance possible of of eliminating some letters. Some examples we should start with are dynamic factory concept. Shut up, Obama. You are boring me. I have thought about it and I have worked it out. I 100% know what the word is. What is it then, Trump? It's obviously the N-word. Whoa, what the fuck, Trump? He's gonna get canceled. Wait, what's wrong with saying the N-word? Trump, I'm serious. You have to shut up now. Why should I shut up? I'm gonna say the N-word right now. Donald, don't you dare. I'm gonna say it. Oh my God, this idiot is going to get himself canceled playing word. Here it comes. I'm gonna say the N-word. You're an idiot, Donald. Say goodbye to your career. The N-word I'm talking about is nuclear. Try typing nuclear, Joe. Jesus Christ, Donald, don't do that to me. You almost gave me a heart attack. Your old age will give you a heart attack soon enough. Don't worry about that, Joe. But what N-word did you two think I was going to say? Never mind, Donald. Let's just try nuclear and move on. We got four letters from that. I love the N-word. It's so good. Oh, my God, Biden. Both of you have to stop. One of you just hurry up and say another word so we can move on. What about Titanic? I wish you were in that Titanic submarine when it imploded, Trump. Jesus Christ, this is even worse. We're going to get canceled. Hurry up and put Titanic and let's move on again. On it, Obama. This is going to be a good word. I can feel it. That was actually pretty good. We've got a lot of information from that. Yes, we did, Barack. And after a lot of hard thought and consideration, I think the word might be bomb again, like it was earlier. Please, Trump, I beg you. Can you please just use your actual brain for once in your life? What about cocaine? You're getting a little bit too excited about cocaine there, Biden. You might want to keep it down a bit before the CIA raid your stash again. Can one of you come up with a decent word, please? What about rotting? Just like how sleepy Joe's brain is rotting from all the drugs he's taking. Joe, just try it. You know he won't shut up till we type his word. Trump, I hope one day you'll choke on all the crap you talk. Maybe I will, Biden, but you'll be long dead by then, seeing as you're 70 years past your expected death date already. You're a walking heart attack waiting to happen. Now hurry up and type rotting, you rotting old man. You do realize I am the president and I can drone strike your house at any time, right? Try me, you old fuck. You'll probably die before calling the order in on your radio. You two shut the fuck up. I want to go home to see my wife and kids and not be playing Wordle with you two morons. We have some good words here. We can get this. I would love to go home and see your wife, Aswell Obama. She was very happy when I was seeing her last night. Donald, you are treading on mighty thin ice, and seeing as how fat you are, you might want to reframe from doing that. Jesus Christ, calm down, Obama. It was just a prank, bro. What word are we going for here, then? It can only be a few words from this spot. Try typing in Craving Joe. I think that will give us the best shot at beating this game. You got it, Obama-rama. Please never call me Obama-rama ever again. I hated that. Good job, Obama-rama. We got all the words except two. Perfect easy. I'll let you two do it from here. You literally can't mess this up. Um, hmm. Oh, come on. Do I have to spell it out for you? All you have to do is literally swap the R and A around and you got it. Uh, I know what it is. Perfect. What is it then? It's bomb again. I fucking hate you so much, Joe type carving in now, so I can go home, I beg you. I think the word is carving. Try typing that in Biden if your old frail fingers still work. You got it, Trumpy Rumpy. I hate these nicknames you're dishing out, Joe, and don't pretend like you came up with that word by yourself, Trump. Shut up, Obama. I told you, idiots, it was carving. 
Once again, the day is saved because of me. You're both useless. Please, everyone, comment below how stupid Trump is. Welcome back, losers. It's Wordle episode two. Hey, guys, it's PewDiePie. That's the wrong intro again, Biden. Oh, I'm sorry. It blows my mind how useless you are, Joe. Starting at three letters and every win makes the words longer. This video is epic. Subscribe to Parody Gaming. Starting with three letter words, guys. This should be nice and easy. Just like Joe Biden's wife. Trump, I will Smith slap the shit you. You keep my wife's name out of your mouth, you pig of a man. We've just started and you two are already arguing, but pig isn't a bad word. Let's try that. Honored Obama, take this Trump, you fat pig. Talking about farm animals, your wife should be in a zoo, Biden. Now type in the word zoo, you stupid old man. Whoa, Trump, both of you need to calm down. We're only playing Wordle here. No, no, no. It's fine, Obama. I'll type in zoo because I have got the perfect word for Trump next. Let's hear it then, you old sick, twisted zookeeper. Why can't we just have a normal game of Wordle for once? How about the word gag? Just like like how Melania Trump's wife will be gagging on me tonight. Jesus Christ, Joe, please, both of you, stop it before we get demonetized again. Okay, fine, I will stop, but I take zero responsibility for this. It's all Grumpy Trumpy's fault. Don't you dare ever call me Grumpy Trumpy ever again. Why not? You are Grumpy and your name is Trumpy. It's just straight facts. To be fair, that's straight bars right there, Joe. I like the nickname Grumpy Trumpy. I hate both of you. I can't wait to be in office again so I can order drone strikes to your houses. Being president does not mean you can just order drones strikes to people's houses, you idiot. We will see, Joe, just you wait. On a more serious note, we are not doing well here, and if we fail on the three-letter word, everyone will unsubscribe. That's fake news, Obama. If people unsubscribe, I will not buy them Lamborghinis, so everyone has to subscribe and stay subscribed, or else... I think that's called blackmail Trump. I am pretty sure that's racist. You cannot say that anymore, Obama. Okay, you're an idiot. You have no idea what blackmail means. Anyway, moving on, we need to try and find out where this A goes. Let's try the word arm. That's a good one, Obama-rama, because we have not used R or M yet either. Joe? If your tongue was any further up Obama's ass, you would be able to taste his food for him. What does that even mean? I don't know what it means either. And I don't want to know what it means, to be honest. Captain Robot, can you just hurry up and work out what this word is so we can move on to four-letter words already? Stop calling me Captain Robot, but we are in a bad spot here. It could be so many words. I thought you were supposed to be so clever. If you two were not such morons at the start and wasted stupid letters on words like zoo and gag, we would have been fine. Come on, Robot Man, work it out. It's probably a McDonald's item. Try the word Mac as in Big Mac. How about the word ate? Because Trump probably ate all the Big Macs because he's so fat. Aha, good one, Joe. And that's actually a pretty good word as we have not used T or E yet either. Thanks, Obama-rama. I don't think Grumpy Trumpy will be happy with that one, but we only need the middle letter now. I was just ordering a McDonald's, guys. I made myself hungry with all the Big Mac talk. What did I miss? Joe came up with a good word, not related to you whatsoever. And we only have one more guess to get the word right. But we now have a problem, guys. What's the problem, Mr. Robot Man? We only need one more letter. Surely you can use your robot brain to work out what it has to be. If the problem is we have too much double chocolate chip ice cream left over, I can help with that. No, Joe, we have no ice cream at all. Oh, that's sad. The dilemma we face is the word can be either axe or ace, and there is no way of knowing which one it could be. It's a total 50-50 chance. I got an idea. Let's ask the comment section on YouTube. Joe, do you understand how YouTube works? Of course I do. Comment below what word you think it is, guys, and I will type it in. He's like a 9,000-year-old shaved caveman stumbling across technology for the first time. Biden, we cannot ask YouTube for the answer because we cannot make this video live until we complete this game. What do you mean? Oh, my God, this is painful. Hurry up and type in Ace and let's move on. I think it's Axe. I've seen how this game is coded Sleepy Joe, and it's 100% Ace. Trust me, bro. Type Ace now and let me show you how good I am at four letters. Just do it, Joe. It's a complete 50-50 chance. And he won't shut up if we don't type ace. Okay, Obama-rama, but only because you said it and not because Grumpy Trumpy said it. Here we go. Good luck us. I'm locking it in. Holy, Holy shit. shit. I told you, morons. I'm the king of Wordle. Good job, Trump. Let's move on to four letters. Right, guys? Looks like we're on the four-letter words now. Oh, I like four-letter words. It's bomb again. Donald, it never was bomb. Yes, it was in the last video we made. I thought you just said the N-word and that you were going to get canceled. No, I didn't say anything like that. But it was 100% bomb last time. Try it again. Sure thing, Trumpy. Don't call me Trumpy, you constipated bag of dust. You see, Trump, not only are you wrong, but you didn't get a single letter correct. For God's sake, this game is coded so poorly. Trump might be onto something. Maybe it's Ace again. 
Ace is a three-letter word, Biden. We need four letters. Aced. Just whack a D on it, Obama, you nerdy robot. Aced could work, and please stop calling me a robot. Captain Robo Obama, sent to Earth to ruin America and teach us all that letters and words are just as important as family. Like Vin Diesel and Fast and Furious. Oh, I love Robo Obama. Oh, fuck off and type in Aced. Typing Ace now, and I will add a D onto it. I hear Michelle loves the D. Trump. Just joking, Obama. Geez, you are almost as moody as Biden today. It isn't Aced. Oh, I'm not gonna lie. This isn't looking very good. Because you guys are absolute morons and aren't taking this seriously. You are such a dork Obama. Oh, good idea, Trumpy. You are useless and senile, Joe. Don't call me Trumpy, and what is a good idea? You called Obama a dork? That's a four-letter word. We are three words in and haven't gotten a single letter correct. Teenage Mutant Ninja Trumpy, Captain Robo Obama, and the President Putus have hit a wall that only three heroes can overcome. What the fuck are you on about? I'm just keeping our viewers updated on the crazy video we are making. This isn't a TV show, Biden. And call me Trumpy one more time, and I'll cut your coke with so much asbestos you and Hunter will be dead in seconds. We need to think really hard on this one. Obama the robot nerd has a point. Think, robot, think. Try typing in suit, S-U-I-T. Sure thing, Obama. I also think suit is a great idea. You're full of shit, Biden. When you fall asleep, I'm gonna punch you square in the face. Oh, yes, finally we're getting somewhere. It's shit. What? S is the first letter, and I is the third letter. The word is shit, like Biden is president. Oh, yes, it's shit. How can it possibly be shit? We already tried tea and it didn't go green. It's not shit. Oh, yes, it's not shit. Shut up, Biden. You are completely useless today. Uh, today, he's useless every day, Obama. I've never seen him say or do anything that a donkey couldn't also do. That's a lie. One time I wrestled a giraffe to the ground with my bare hands. You both watch way too many movies, and I think the next word should be plan. I think P, L, and N are very common consonants we can learn lots from. For once, I agree, Obama typing plan in right now. I'm surprised you even know the word plan, Biden. Come on, come on, please. Yes, I know what it is. Yes, I know you know what plan means, Barack. No, the word Trump, the word is spin. Are you sure it's not nuke? In the last video, the word was nuke. Hmm, spin or nuke, what shall I type? Joe, why on earth would it be nuke? Trump says this game glitches sometimes, and it was nuke last video. No, it wasn't. Based on what I see on screen today, it's either tank, guns, nuke, or bomb again like last time. Okay, I think it's nuke, too. Sure thing, Obama. Nuke it is. This game is easy. I knew it. Stop! What? Please, Joe, I was bluffing and you are too old to realize. You almost gave me a heart attack, Obama. Do it again, Barack. Kill him. The answer is spin. Remove nuke and type in spin and I will buy you a chocolate chip ice cream cone. Oh, amazing, Obama. And I was just playing. Of course, it's spin. Chocolate chip. Jesus Christ. And that is how it's done, ladies and gents. Five-letter words now, guys. Let's try and pick up the pace a little bit on this one. No arguing. Let's think smart and get this one done fast. I have worked it out. You have worked what out, Donald? The fucking word, you robot. What do you think? How can you possibly have worked it out? We have no letters yet. Can you just suggest a word without thinking you 100% know the answer for once? I don't need to suggest anything, robot man. I have worked out the algorithm in this game. What's an algorithm? If you interrupt me ever again, old man, I will beat the living shit out of you with your own walking stick. Calm down, Donnie. I'm always calm. Now type in the word bombs. The word is 100% bombs. My dog is called Major. I like my dog. Can we type in Major instead? Fuck your dog, Biden. What the fuck? You leave Major alone. That was harsh, Donnie. Major did nothing wrong. Try Major Joe. It's a good word. Why are you trying his shit, dog, and not my word? I already told you the answer is bombs. The answer is not bombs, Donnie. Stop talking crap about Joe's dog. Yeah, leave Major out of this, Donnie. I heard a rumor somewhere about how you put peanut butter on your balls and you let Major lick it off. Is that true, Sleepy Joe? Um, no, of course not. I can't lie, I have heard that rumor as well. Is it actually true, Joe? Can we move on, please? It's getting really hot in my room all of a sudden. Oh my God, it is true. You get your dog to lick peanut butter off your bowl. No, it is not. I'm just hot. My AC broke, I promise. Obama, help me with this. Why did you call Major in the room? I bet he can help cool you down. You don't sound very convincing, to be honest, Joe. I'm just going to put balls so we can quickly move on. And can everyone just ignore what was just said, please? Nope. No one is ever forgetting what was just said. Everyone will know you as the senile old man that gets his balls licked by his dog from now on. Please, let's move on. Yes, come on, let's drop it. I wanted to do this round fast. I already told you the answer is bombs. The four-letter word was bombs, so this five-letter word must be bombs. It's simple math, Obama. It's not bombs, you idiot. Stop saying that. And how is that simple math? Oh, yes, the four-letter word was bombs, so he might be right. No, Joe, stop. 
The four-letter word was not a bomb. He's just an idiot. Trust me, bro. It's bombs, no cap. No, I am not listening to you anymore, you oversized fucking Oompa Loompa. Get wrecked, grumpy Trumpy. Try the word adult Joe so we can get a better idea of where the A and L belong. You got it, Obama Rama the Llama? I think Joe has just discovered what rhyming is, and I absolutely hate it. Ha <laughs> you suck, Obama. You got no new letters. Damn, we're in really bad shape again. We need a good word here. Shut up, Obama, you dweeb. Hey, Joe, try the word dweeb. I like that word. It suits robot man very nicely. Yeah. Shut up, Trump. I'm not a robot, and I don't think dweeb is even a word. Oh, my God, it actually is. Of course it's a word. I'm a genius. We are in really bad shape now. We need a miracle to win this round. What should I put, Obama? You've got the best chance of us beating this game. Yes, come on, robot man. Think. Think, God damn it. Try the word plain, Joe. We really need some green letters here so we can work this one out. If a word could sum up Biden, it would be plain. He is the most plain and boring person I have ever met. Fuck, we have no green letter and one guess left. Guess we'll just have to try bombs and move on then, guys. No, I feel like I'm tripping on acid every time I talk to you two fucking morons. Just give me a second to think about this. We don't have all day Obama. The subscribers are getting bored. Let's just put bombs. I think I got it. Let's hear it, Obama the llama. Uh, well, it has to end in an L as it's yellow everywhere else. And the second, the last letter uh, as to be A and we have an I and an N left over, so logically it has to be the word final. Try that, Biden. Sounds good to me, Barack. I'll punch it in. Yes, what a save that was. Good teamwork, guys. Trump, you did literally nothing there apart from make it harder for us. You're such a fucking dweeb, Barack. It's embarrassing. Ignore him, Rahm Obama. I thought that was very impressive. Thanks, Joe. Let's smash the six letters out now. Six letter words. Now, Jesus Christ, this is taking ages. Oh, Grumpy Trumpy's getting tired. I'm not tired, you deranged ball bag. Sleepy Joe and Grumpy Trumpy, what word are you wanting to start with? You're an asshole, Obama. Asshole is seven letters, Trump. How about Grumpy? Ooh, I will type that now, good old grumpy Trumpy. Hey, that wasn't actually a bad word to go with. How are you still alive, Biden? Healthy eating and exercise, Trump. Doubt you've ever done either. Oh, you just got burned. I'll fucking burn you, Biden, and throw your ashes into Hunter's stash so he snorts you. Jesus Christ, Donald. You look like an alien Trump, some fat orange blob sent down to ruin this planet and suck the life out of everything. Alien is a perfect word. A-I and E, that's genius. There's no life to suck out of you, Biden. That died years ago. You're just an expired skin bag walking around with launch codes and cocaine. I'm going to ignore you now, Trumpy, and type in aliens. Good idea, Obama. Oh, yes, now we know four out of the six letters. You are both rubbish at this game. I already know the answer. No, you don't, Trump. There's no way you know the answer. The answer is kaboom. It's right there in plain sight. Oh, like a bomb. I love kabooms. Have you learned nothing in our first Wordle video, you moron? That's racist, Obama. You should be ashamed. I'm not racist, Donald, you absolute moron. Yeah, Trump, it's impossible for Obama to be racist. Well, that's not true either. I could be racist if I wanted to be. Everyone watching this video, subscribe if you think Obama is racist. What? No, I'm not. Oh my God, I never knew. Ah, uh, get pranked, Obama. I'm so confused. Are we being racist for views and subscribers now? No, Joe, we 100% are not. Trump is being an asshole. Type in racism, Biden. It's a good word for wordle. Oh, for God's sake. Roger that, Trumpy. I'm typing it in right now. I guess it's not a bad word. Ooh, oh, look at all that green. I love racism. Careful, Biden. I don't think you should say that. I have finally cracked the code to wordle. It's constantly trying to trick us. Us. The next word should be sexism. It's perfect. Sexism is a terrible word for wordle. We already know it doesn't end in ism. I have a very strange feeling that this episode will get us canceled. That's fake news, Biden. Now type in sexism. Okie cokey, Trumpy Wumpy, typing in sexism now. I can't believe we are going to fail this round. Oh dear, this is actually not looking good. I was sure it was sexism. Yeah, me too. It was never going to be sexism. Jesus Christ. Fuck it, I have an idea. What? what? Remember that movie, Ted? I'm going to quick fire every six letter word I know that starts with R and A. And you losers think fast. I don't get it. Go for it, Trumpy Rumpy. Racing radios, rafted, random, ragged rails, rained, ramble, ramped, ranged, rapes, rapids, rarest, rashes, rabbit, racket, racial, racism, racket, raging, ransom, ranger, rarely, ratify, rattle, ravage, rather, racy, are racked, radial, radish, rafale, rafter, rained, raised, razor, raisin, rallied, rallies. Stop. Fucking rallies? No, it's random. That was like the fourth word I said. I know, but holy fuck, I wanted to see how long you could go for us. That was crazy. I honestly think out of everything you have ever done, Donald, that is by far the best thing by far. Type it in, Joe. Random is perfect. I'm going to have another bite of my Big Mac to help catch my breath. Wow. wow. If we don't start this round with the word freedom, the viewers will riot, and I will be the leader of that riot. Put freedom right now, Biden, before I punch you in the face. A bit of, uh, aggressive there, grumpy Trumpy. You could have just asked. I don't need to ask. I tell you what to do, and you do it, old man. Freedom is the second best word in the dictionary, right behind the greatest and freest country in the world, America. Now type in America, Joe. Hang on there, Trump. No shut up, Obama. This is for the great American citizens. 
Type in America Joe, and then we can all go home. Oh, God, here we go. What the fuck? Not a word. What is this fucking shit? I was trying to tell you it was not a word in the dictionary, Trump. It was China, wasn't it? I bet China stole our country like they steal everything else. The rats. Hey, Joe, try typing in Chinese to see. I'll give it a go, grumpy Trumpy. No, wait, it doesn't work like that, Trump. It has nothing to do with China. I fucking knew it. China did steal our country. They will pay for this. Trump, please, I want to go one video without the fear of us getting canceled. Hey, Joe, why don't you pick a word? Oranges. That was fast, old man. How did you come up with that so quick? Well, I just looked at your Oompa Loompa looking ass and instantly thought of oranges. Damn, Joe, sick burn. Can we get some ice for Donnie over here? Fuck both of you. I don't need ice. I got ice in my veins because I'm a legend. Hurry up, robot man, and get this word. I want to move on to eight-letter words now. I, I know the answer, the eight-letter word already. There's no possible way you already know the answer to the eight-letter word, but I agree we should speed this up. Hey, Joe, punch and renewal. We should hopefully find out where the second E belongs with that word, along with any other vowels. You are such a nerd, Obama. It's actually embarrassing to be in the same room as you. Wow, Obama the llama. So many green and yellow letters. We might do this round in record-breaking time. I think I actually know what it is from here. Whatever you dorks, just call me when we start the eight-letter word round, as I already know the answer to that one. The R has to be the last letter, which makes N likely to be the fifth letter, so I think the word has to be veteran. Try that, Joe. Joe is like a veteran of the human race. One of the first ever humans born. You can see how unevolved and old he is. Yes, what a guess. That was a really good round. Well done, guys. Let's do eight letter words now. Well, I will be the first to admit that I have no idea what to suggest for eight letters. It's okay, Joe. Now it gets really challenging. Let's think of some really strong words that represent America. How about railroad? You cannot say railroad represents America Trump. Those times are not good to look back on. I agree, Joe. I was thinking of something like campaign or baseball. Type campaign greedy, Joe. Chances of you surviving until the next one are very slim. I'm typing in campaign because my my brother from another mother suggested it, not because I agree with you, Donald. Oh, and it's perfect. One green and two yellows. You are 100% a virgin, Obama, you sexless robot. How am I a virgin? I have children. Yeah, Trump, work on your insults. Obama is a virgin, and Biden, your penis rot off years ago, so I don't know why you're even talking. And Trump, you are the fattiest person I know. In fact, that's an eight-letter word. The insults are brutal today, and Trump has been burned so many times, I've lost count. Surprise, everyone. Biden tries a new word, and it doesn't help us at all. You suggest a word, then, Donald. I bet $50 that yours is worse than mine. If you hate my railroad idea, then how about roadkill? As in, I'm gonna hit Joe with my car and leave him on the side of the road so some homeless guy with a horny dog can eat him and bang him. That is not an image I wanna have in my head at all. And it won't have any colored letters either. It might have a couple, actually, as it's a very good word. Come on, Obama-rama, we're supposed to be on the same team. Oh, for fuck's sake. Ha, ah, it's almost perfect. Screw this, I bet it's something from my childhood. Something Trump is too forgetful to remember. I bet it's snickety. What? Oh my God, he's finally lost it. Get the camera out, Obama. He's gonna die. Snickety. As in, ooh, I'm so hungry, I'm gonna go grab a snickety snack. I don't think that's a word, Joe. I'm typing it in now to prove to Trump how I'm coming up with better words so more people like the video. Sometimes I just feel bad for you, Joe, like a lost sheep that is too old and crusty and just needs to die. I'm so confused this game is glitching out again. Don't worry, Biden. I'm sure they will fix it before the next video. Thank you, Robo Obama, for those kind words. But unfortunately, he will be dead by morning. Obama, I think we need your help. Speak for yourself, Biden. I don't stutter in my speeches and have helped the most in this entire video. And I have never fell down the stairs of Air Force One. Come on, man. That happened one time. I have a strange theory, Biden. Can you try the word hair work? Sure thing. Bananarama? That's not a word. Not hair word, Joe. Hair work. Biden, isn't it amazing how you can be so old and still learn something new every day? Oh, Jesus Christ. What's up, Obama? Rama. This is perfect. Great idea. It's not my word I'm freaking out about. What is it, Obama? You're being a robot again. We need human reactions and emotion to understand what you are saying. Move over, Biden. I have one more word to try. All okay, Obama. What is the word you are thinking? Oh, fuck off. No fucking way. What? I'm a legend. I knew it. I've been telling you the entire time. Holy shit. Subscribe to Parody Gaming for more epic videos. What's up, losers? Episode three of Presidents Play Wordle. Cool. Good mythical morning. Third time in a row, that's the wrong channel, Biden. Whoops a daisy. Sleepy Joe is useless, and this video is genius. This is custom wordle where we pick the words and the other two presidents compete against each other. This video is awesome. Subscribe to Parody Gaming. Let's go. I'm so excited for this one, guys. Me too, Joe. This should be fun. Shut up, both of you. I have a good word. I want to start first. No, Donnie. We decided before we started recording that Joe was going to start first, remember? Yeah, but I have thought of an amazing word now. Why does that decrepit old man get to go before me? Because that's 
that's what we decided, Donnie. We will all get a turn. You just got to beat me in this one V1 and guess Joe's word before me and you will get to go next. Jesus, Obama, calm down, bro. I'm going to smoke you in this one V1, though. They don't call me the wordle master for nothing. We will see, Donald, but this will be exciting. By the end of this video, we will see who the true king of wordle is. If I win this round, everyone watching has to subscribe. Great. So I'm guessing no one is going to subscribe then. We will see, Mr. Robot Obama. We will see. I have got my word, guys. It's a really good one. There's no way either of you are going to get it. Do you want to have the first guess, Donald, since you are so eager to start? Shut up, Barack. You're boring me. I'm going first, and I'm going to guess it first try like I do every time. He's never going to drop it, that he guessed it right that one time, Jesus Christ. It's obviously a McDonald's item, and knowing that sick, twisted old man, it's probably ice cream related, so the word is 100% McFlurry. Uh, I'm actually worried about how much you think and talk about McDonald's. <laughs> you are wrong, Donnie, you fat fuck. Whoa, calm down, Joe. That was a bit aggressive. I'm sorry, just with us all competing against each each other got me a bit fired up there. If you ever talk to me like that ever again, old man, I will come down to that White House, beat the living crap out of you, and steal all your cocaine. Let's call that strike one. Please not the cocaine. I just wish we could all play a game in peace like normal people. Shut up, Mr. Robot Man, and hurry up and take your turn. Fine. I think I'm going to be helping you out here with this word, Donnie, but uh, I want to try and find out where some vowels are. So the word I'm going for is meditate. You are such a try-hard Obama, it's embarrassing. Good word, Obama Rama the Llama, though. A lot of yellow letters from that one. Damn it. I have just noticed something really bad, though. What's wrong, robot man? Are your batteries running low? No, you moron. I am not a robot, you overweight flaming hot Cheeto. But you should be able to get Joe's word from this spot. There is only one word in the dictionary it can be. Mm, is it McFlurry? Oh my God, this is painful. Hey, Joe, I feel bad beating this moron so easily. How about giving him a clue? Okay, here comes your clue, Trump. You were actually pretty close with the word McFlurry. The word starts with I-C-E, and it's really cold. It's fireball. You fucking idiot. Yes, Donnie, you're right. It's 100% fireball. Lock it in. How can you possibly think it's fireball, Trump? Because Joe is trying to trick me by saying it's something cold. And what's the opposite of something cold? And massive explosion in the form of a fireball. Please just use your brain and stop thinking this game is trying to trick you. He already said it starts with I-C-E. Shut up, Captain Nerd Obama. I'm locking it in. Oh, God, here we go. What the actual fuck? How is it not fireball? Sleepy Joe, you're hacking the game and changing the word halfway through, aren't you? Ha-ha, <laughs> unlucky, grumpy, trumpy, rumpy. That's strike two, old man. Stop making up these stupid nicknames before I pull the plug on your life support machine. Okay, sorry, Donnie, but I'm going to end this round now and take the win here. The word is obviously ice maker. Ha ha, suck it, Mr. Robot Man. You are terrible at this game. What, how is the word not ice maker, Joe? I think the word is kind of obvious, Obama-rama. If the word is ice cream, I will lose my shit, Biden. Why, what's wrong with ice cream? I love ice cream. I know you love ice cream, but ice cream is not a fucking word. It is two separate words, you idiot. It's obviously ice cream, Barack. Use your brain. I thought you were supposed to be smart or something. Oh my God, this was a bad idea. You cannot just make up words, you morons, or this is going to be impossible to play. Shut up, you nerd. The score is one to me and zero to the robot. Now it's my turn to make up the word. I have gone for a four-letter word for you guys to guess. It's an amazing word, and I don't think either of you will get it within the six allowed guesses. It's bomb, isn't it? Wait, what? No, of course it's not. Okay, it's definitely bomb. I'm locking in bomb straight away. What the fuck? How did you get that, Obama? You hacked into the wordle with your fucking robot brain, didn't you? No, you moron. You just say the word is bomb every single fucking time we play this game. So when you picked a four-letter word, it was obvious it was bomb. What happened? I didn't even get to play the game. Sorry, Joe. Blame Trump for that one for picking a terrible word. Score is one to me and Trump and zero to Biden so far. And as I got that one right, it's my turn to pick the word. Obama, I think you might hold the record for the world's most boring voice ever. Hurry up and get on with it. Let's ask the comment section. Hey, guys, comment below if you think Obama has the world's most boring voice or not. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Jesus Christ, Biden thinks he's Logan Paul. Don't get any ideas of vlogging in Japan now, Sleepy Joe. Shut up, both of you. Let's move on. I have decided my word for you two to guess. I bet it's some stupid, nerdy, 15-letter long robot word. Actually, I have gone for quite a simple eight-letter word to give you guys a chance of winning because I know how stupid you both are. Joe, it's your turn to start. Is it deathbed by any chance? Because that's where you should be right now with me slowly unplugging your life support machine? No, it's ice cream, of course. No, Joe, stop. 
We discussed this earlier. Ice cream is not a fucking word. Ha ha, I'm gonna win this easily. Joe, you are a walking, living disaster. Oh wait, disaster is a good word. I'm gonna try that. Hang on there, Donald. Let me give you two a clue to make it easier for you. I don't need your stupid clue, Dr. Nerd. I'm Donald Trump, the legend himself, AKA the Wordle King. And Sleepy Joe is a disaster and it's getting locked Stop in. Stop saying locked in like you are on who wants to be a millionaire. We're playing Wordle. Oh, I love who wants to be a millionaire. I wanna use my phone, a friend lifeline. We're not playing who wants to be a millionaire, Joe. Yeah, and even if we were, you have no friends to phone as they all died from old age years ago. Now hurry up and take your turn. Wait, let me give you two a clue on what the word is. What is my clue then, Obama-rama? I'm using my clue lifeline. You will both have one of these next year, as long as Trump doesn't go to prison before then, that is. I know what it is, it's election. You won't be having an election as you'll be in prison because you're a criminal Trumpy rumpy. That's a good word, I'm going for criminal. Oh my God, do either of you ever use your brain on this game? Haha, <laughs> you suck, Joe. I'm typing in election and winning this game. Trump, it can't be election. You can see it starts with the letter C. Use your brain. Unlucky, grumpy, Trumpy, rumpy. I'm going for the word ceremony because I will be having a ceremony when I win next year's presidential campaign. The only ceremony you will be having is the one at your funeral when I finally put you in that coffin, old man. Damn it, you were so close, Joe. You even said the word in your last sentence. Hi, you idiot. I know the word. It's campaign, as in presidential campaign. It's so obvious, Sleepy Joe, you moron. Hang on, Trump. Take your time. Make sure you spell it correctly. Oh, what the fuck? How is that wrong? Robot man, you hacked my PC and changed what I put, didn't you? No, you idiot. You just didn't take your time and you spelt it wrong. Ha ha, unlucky, grumpy, Trumpy. Why don't you go play in traffic, Biden, you bag of useless shit? Right, my turn. I've had enough of you, Trump. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, dear. You know exactly what it means, you fucking fat boy. I'm guessing, Donald, that the word is related to you in some way. A six letter word that describes me. This could be anything from the word perfect to the word sex god. I guarantee that it's none of those words, Trump. I'm sorry, Donald, but Biden and you are not friendly towards each other at all. I doubt the word is a compliment. Is it the N word? What? No, it is not. And don't you dare type that in, Donald. I think this is a trick. I think it's the N-word. No! Please, Donald, we can't get demonetized again. Are you sure? Because Biden has been full of surprises today. Please, Trump, the word is 100% not the N-word. It's something related to you. Get fucking pranked. I'm not typing the N-word. I'm typing in nachos. Oh, thank God. You almost gave me a heart attack, Donald. Almost isn't good enough. I will have to try harder next time. And how is nachos a word that is anything about you, Trump? Because Biden is stupid and thinks because I don't like nachos that this word would annoy me. How do you not like nachos? They are amazing. Oh, for God's sake, is this because it's a Mexican dish, Trump? Yes, unfortunately, my great wall has not prevented nachos from entering our great nation. First of all, Donald, your wall is dog shit and was never finished. And secondly, I'm 99% sure that the nachos in America are made in America. This sounds like fake news, Obama. Oh, I thought that when you order nachos at a restaurant that the waiter runs out the back and phones someone in Mexico, then some young boy on a motor scooter delivers the nachos to the restaurant as fast as he can so that it's still warm when it arrives. I'm going to ignore that and type in orange as Biden has called Trump an orange blob many times over the past few videos. Unlucky Obama, it's not orange. This is ridiculous. Biden is by far the most useless and senile person here. How can we even trust him to come up with a real word? Although ice cream technically isn't a word, I'm sure the same mistake hasn't been made twice in a row, Donald. Yes, I checked the dictionary and it's 100% a real word that describes you perfectly Trumpy Rumpy. Well, clearly it's not bomb as Biden wouldn't be that smart to trick us all. It also wouldn't be bomb as it's a six letter word you are looking for, Trump. Yes, but as we have learned recently, Wordle can sometimes trick you. There hasn't been a single time that Wordle has tricked us, Donald, not one time. Agree to disagree, Obama as you clearly haven't been paying much attention. Guess the next word, Donald, or are you too scared? The only thing that scares me, Biden, is the fact that it's possible you could die peacefully in your sleep and that I won't get to watch you fall in pain and vaporize on the floor like a vampire struck by sunlight. That is both brutal and poetic, Donald, but please type your word. My next word is wealth, as Biden is so jealous of my good looks, my intelligence, and of course, my massive, wealthy lifestyle. Nope, wrong again. Oh, for God's sake, I was so sure it was wealth. Now for my turn, I'm getting so confused. I cannot think of a single word using the information already gathered that could represent Trump. This is an easy one, Obama-rama. You got this. Yes, robot man, think long and hard as you will fail again as I know the answer now. I'm typing in the word bamboo, as it's the only real word I can think of that fits here. Wrong again, Obama-rama, but that's a lot of green letters. Biden, you useless hemorrhoid, I know exactly what your word is. It's legend. It's obviously not legend, Donald. Look at the green letters. Oh, for fuck's sake. Biden, you liver-spotted zombie, you have made up a word that doesn't exist. I have not made up a word, fat boy. This word 100% exists and is exactly what you are. Oh, Jesus Christ, Joe, I know what it is. What is it, robot man? Oh, good thinking, Obama, you win. Fat boy. 
boy, that's not even a word. I'm happy of one, but I'm sorry, Joe, this isn't even a real word. You said you checked the dictionary? Yeah, the urban dictionary. Fuck's sake. sake. Joe, that's not a real dictionary. Sure it is, fat boy. A big, ginormous boy with man tits. Also a fat person who refers to themselves as legend or wealthy. Although I might have added that bit. Looks like I won, so it's my go again. No, Obama, this is bullshit. It's my turn, and I have the perfect word to sum up Joe Biden. The zombie fuckhead that will be dead very, very soon. Bring it on, you fat orange criminal. Biden versus Obama, a seven-letter word that reminds everyone of Joe. And remember, Biden, I'm guessing this isn't going to be a kind word. Yes, but it might also be a trick. Trump knows the algorithm of Wordle and might trick me into losing. You think Trump won't insult you, and instead he has outsmarted the coding of this game just so that you lose this round? Exactly. Biden it blows my mind how useless you really are. And I will give you a clue. I have not hacked the Wordle for this round. Oh, good. Then for that reason, I'm going for the word history. What? Ah, uh, Joe, I have no idea how you got there, but it's a start, at least. You see, Obama, I'm the greatest president in the history of America. But in Trump's delusional mind, I am the worst in history. Either way, history. Delusional? You have literally fucked up every speech you have ever done. Fell over on stage and on Air Force One. You talk about ice cream at the most inappropriate times and so fucking old that you look like you should have died years ago. Oh, I do love chocolate chip. Well, Trump, you have some good points, but it's my turn for the next word. Any clues? Yes, here's a clue. When you think of this word, you think of Biden. Oh, useless. Hey, Obama-rama, that's kind of mean that you think of that. Sorry, Joe, but it's straight facts. Hey, ha, Biden, you really are useless. Only an E, Dom, I thought I got it. Don't worry, Obama-lama ding-dong, we are still best friends. All good bitey whitey flubble nuts. What the fuck was that? You guys keep saying Trumpy Wompy and Obama La Mama. I thought I would try a nickname. It just sounded weird from you, Obama Rama, but it's all okay. It's not okay that was fucking weird, like wiping your ass with the wrong hand. Please, let's move on to the next word. Okay, me next. Can I have a clue, Trump? Here's your clue, Biden. It's something we all do sometimes, but you are a piece of shit that does it too much. I keep trying to look at myself through Trump's eyes, but it's really hard and my head hurts. Just imagine looking at something so useless and so pathetic that you are disgusted at how this person is alive and needs to be put down. Oh my God, how brutal is this word you have written, Donald? I'm actually scared. It's not that bad. And hurry up, Biden, or have you died on us? I'm still alive, you inbred-looking Oompa Loompa. What's your word, Joe? My word is corrupt, as in Trump is so corrupt that he thinks all presidents are corrupt, too. Oh, nice one, Joe. The word we are looking for starts with C and O. I am not corrupt. That is 100% fake news, and you guys are still so, so far away. Right. Well, it is my turn next. I have a good idea what the final word is, but I'm going with a different word to guarantee a few more letters just in case. You're such a nerdy robot. You talk with no emotion and nobody will subscribe if they can't relate to you, Obama. How are people relating to you, Trump? Nobody watching is that fat and orange. Because everyone who comments on this video share my hatred of you, Biden. Plus, just like all poor people, I love McDonald's. Shut it, Donald. We are going to lose subscribers. Subscribe now if you think Obama is a nerdy robot boy. He's a man, not a boy, Donald. And you're fucking old. What's your word, Robo-Obama? I'm going with ancient as it covers different locations for the letters we already know. Oh, that guess is perfect, Obama-rama. So close, but so far away. And Biden still has no idea where he is. Screw you, Trump. Give me a clue. Here's your clue, Biden. Everyone knows you and your stupid son, Hunter, are full of this word. Oh, well, that is easy. The word is capable. What the fuck? Even I know that's not something both you and Hunter are. Hey, Obama, don't be mean. I'm the president, and Hunter is a very capable young man. He's 53 years of age. Yeah, but compared to Biden, that is a very young man. Oh, look, three green letters wasn't too bad, actually. Not that I need it, but what is your last clue, Donald? My word is a white powder and Biden snorts it with his son all day long and was recently discovered in the White House where only Joe Biden hangs out because all he does is snort drugs all day long. Jesus Christ, well, I guess everyone knew this was coming. The answer is cocaine. I'm a genius. Comment below what other games you want us to play on Parody Gaming.